Hi, my name is Karthik and I am from executeautomation.com and welcome to the all new series of Kwaipu, an advanced wrapper for Selenium. It's a intuitive robust browser automation for .NET. So what is Kwaipu? Well, this guy is Kwaipu, but we are not really going to talk about this guy here. Rather, we can talk about the Kwaipu for automation testing. So Kwaipu is an advanced wrapper on the top of Selenium. So Kwaipu supports browser automation in .NET to help make tests readable, robust, fast to write, and less tightly coupled to the UI, which is pretty interesting. If your tests are littered with sleeps, retries, complex XPath expressions, and IDs dug out of source with Firebug, then Kwaipu might help you. Because I see most of the people who are doing automation with Selenium, they always try to maintain these objects by writing an XPath and so complex XPath and putting a thread dot sleep, even if it is a very bad practice, but still people are really using that thread dot sleep. Sometimes a little more generic wait statements and a lot of retries and all those stuff. But Kwaipu is a wrapper which helps you to come out of all these problems, which means as Kwaipu has evolved over a period of time, the tool understood the pain points of Selenium testers. Hence, you don't really have to think of creating browser objects and working with different browsers, finding controls by complex XPaths and CSS, etc. Well, in this course, we're really going to talk about these stuffs. So where can I find Kwaipu then? You can find Kwaipu from GitHub. It's a open source, free wrapper. So here is the place for a Kwaipu. You can just go to this GitHub and you can to a new pull request and download the source code for Kwaipu. But the better way of doing or working with Kwaipu is to just download as a NuGet package. So in this series, we're gonna talk about Kwaipu a lot. So let's get started. 